Hi, my name is Jim England and I work for Protex Pest Control Services and I've been involved in the pest control industry for the past 10 years. Common Clothes Moth is something that we get called out to deal with a hell of a lot these days. Now I'm going to show you how to get rid of moths in your house. What we do have are, we have things like this. This is a sticky pheromone lure. Now, insects communicate using pheromones. So what this one does is very, very sticky. We peel this off and what we're gonna do, we're gonna place a pheromone impregnated pad in the middle of the trap. So that goes on there. What that's doing now, that's sending out a signal. Um, it's mimicking the female moth um, ho um, pheromone to say to the male moth that she's ready to breed. So that then basically folds up like so. And then these tend to work better when they're suspended. So what you do, you would typically hang something like this in a wardrobe or from a light fitting. That's then gonna act as a, as a pheromone trap. The pheromone then is radiating outwards from the trap and basically the moths fly along, fly towards it and they end up sticking. Right, so we're talking about clothes moths and what we can do to prevent them from attacking our clothes in the first place. Now, moths are going to be mostly going to be attracted to um, clothes that have got like a high wool content. So during the uh, summer months when you're not going to be wearing this sort of stuff, ideally what you want to do is put it away in storage, but you want to put it away in such a way that the moths can't get to it. And one of the things you can do to do that is you can get these bags now. Again, you can order them online or you can get them in the high street. And what it is, it's a vacuum bag. So what you do, and the next thing we have to do is basically seal it up. And it's got a very airtight seal so that the air can't escape or get back in. You have to make sure that you get every little bit of air. So we've sealed the bag. And then the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna extract the air from it. So what you're left with is a vacuum packed bag. Now, nothing can survive in there. Okay, another handy little tip is something like this pashmina. Again, gonna be very attractive to the moths. Now, you might not wanna go to the expense of getting it dry cleaned. Obviously, you can't stick it through the wash, but what you can do is you can put it in a bag and you can put it in the freezer. And if you put it in the freezer for a couple of days, um, the extreme cold will kill off any larvae or any eggs that happen to be on it, and that's how to get rid of moths in your house. <laughs>